have an opening hood here and there's our engine there it says a Jeep V6 so that's really cool and so I really like the suspension the tow hitch the steering and as well as the big beefy tires here so as you can see we can move around the wheels here and this also has like sort of shocks inside the little springs and so when you squish it and as you can see it'll let some string out here and it has a little Lego hitch which is really cool and you can position the steering wheel so you can drive it around and that's really really cool hey everybody Kaiden here and today I have the Lego Technic Jeep Wrangler and this is set 42122 it has 665 pieces and is recommended for ages 9 and up and so this looks like a really cool kit and I'll be doing a speed build and review so let's go ahead and check this out all right everybody so here is the box and I gotta say I really like the box art uh, definitely looks like this is ready for off-roading as you can see we have a mountain in the background and trees and it's going over some rocks here displaying a play feature which is the suspension which is really cool and this is also licensed by Jeep as you can see it's a Jeep licensed product so that is really cool and also on the top here it shows the actual size of the wheel that you're gonna get which is really cool and on the back here, we can see some specs about the real life Jeep Wrangler, and as well as some really cool play features there. And so let's go ahead and open this up. Looks like, oh my gosh, these never work. All right. <laughs> there we go. Wow, there's a lot of stuff in here and it looks like that is all in the box. Okay, so inside of the box we get bag number two, bag number one, bag number one, and two more bag number twos. And we also get five loose tires and these are like big and beefy. And we also get our sticker sheet here and of course our instructions and it's a pretty thick instruction booklet so let's go ahead and open up all of our bags of bricks and build And we'll just set apart these bag number twos for later on. All right, that is all of our bag number ones. And so let's go ahead and get building.
All right, everybody, so we have finished the Jeep Wrangler, and I gotta say, it turned out really good, although it did take me almost up to three hours, and my fingers are really sore, so this is definitely a very, very long kit, and I'm really satisfied that we're now done, so let's go ahead and take a look at the car. Okay, so here is the Jeep Wrangler, and I gotta say, this is a really, I mean, really, really awesome Lego set. It's probably one of the most best Lego sets that I have gotten. It's really cool. So overall, it looks really nice and definitely does look like the uh, Jeep Wrangler. And they got the tail lights nice. And they've also got headlights nice as well. And they just mastered the look and everything with all the stickers and stuff, such as the door handle and also a bunch of other branding and cool things. And so here are some really cool play features of this. First of all, we have here a working tow hinge right here. So this is really cool. So pretty much what you do is you're supposed to wind this gear up here. And as you can see, it'll let some string out here and it has a little Lego hitch. And it's pretty much just wound up in string right here. And you can go ahead and say like, oh man, uh, why did I take my GTR off road and now it's all ruined and I need to get out. And then so Mr. Jeep comes along here and he can be, oh, dang it, I can't really hook onto your wing. I don't want to break that off. So what you can either do is you can either loosely find points to attach to, such as like right here, to start hauling it. Or even though that this has a little Lego stud here, you can just even put it in like say this exhaust here, just for uh, the purpose here, since we can't really find a point where to attach it onto. And then what's really cool is that you can start winding up the string here. As you can see, you can tow your GTR out. And so that's really cool. I really like that they have function here with our little tow hinge. And so that is one of the coolest play features on this. And another one is that we have an opening hood here and there's our engine there. It says Jeep V6. So that's really cool. And the funny thing is, is that this is just a chair. And so they just put this Jeep V6 sticker on here. And then when you put it down, it looks like a little engine. So that's really cool. And also, we have opening doors here, as you can see. For some reason, I'm not sure why this uh, mirror is trying to not go with the door. But as you can see on this side, the mirror goes with the door, and that's really cool. And also, on the interior here, we have a steering wheel, which is really cool. And you can position the steering wheel. And as well as seats with stickers on them, and so they're nice and detailed. And we also have steering here. So in the back, we have this little knob, which controls the uh, two front wheels there to steer. So you can drive it around. And that's really, really cool. And we also have probably one of the coolest play features here is we have suspension. So as you can see, we can move around the wheels here. And this also has like sort of shocks inside. There's little springs. And so when you squish it, it goes up like a real car. And it really really is have the look of off-roadiness. So as you can see, if I go over my hand here, it bounces up. And then the back shocks are a little bit hard to try to actuate because they're an actual spring. But as you can see from the front view here, if we run over my hand, it goes along with the body. And that is really cool. A really cool feature that I like. And I honestly really like this. It's super cool. It has a lot of the cool play features and they really mastered the look of the Jeep Wrangler. And so those are all the play features on this. And now one thing that I do have to say though, is compared to the real car, as you can see, right here we have for reference, for some reason, the driver side windows and basically like the whole main chassis parts um oh what the oh that we have here it seems a little bit higher than what it would be on this lego here so this one looks just a little bit squished like a little bit smaller compared to our real car here that's the only thing i have to say and they also had the addition of adding these off-road lights up here on top but if you want you can always remove them as you can see we can take them off and you can have a regular Jeep if you want. Or if you want to, you can put them back on just like this. And so it is a really, really cool set. It is very awesome. And oh, I'm having some issue putting this back here. There we go. 
So overall, this is an amazing kit, and I gotta say, wow, they really did a good job on this set. I wasn't expecting this to be so, so crazy, like really, really good. And so I really like the suspension, the tow hitch, the steering, and as well as the big beefy tires here. And so that is what is so amazing about this. And I definitely do give this set a big, big thumbs up. This is probably on my top three favorite Lego set list. This is really cool. All right, everybody, so that is the Jeep Wrangler. And I gotta say, this is an amazing set and is definitely one of my top favorite sets now, probably in the top three, because uh, it is so amazing and everything in here is really, really nice. And this is definitely not the set for you beginners out there, because first of all, it's a Lego Technic set. And also the thing with this is that this took me over three hours and I was trying to speed run this too. And thankfully I didn't make any mistakes, so Definitely not a kit for the beginners, but for you avid LEGO builders like me, this is an awesome set to buy. So, I hope you guys enjoyed my video. If you did, it'd be very appreciated if you would give me a like. And also, if you're new here and want to see more videos like these, it'd be very appreciated and liked of you if you were to subscribe. And also, if you want to see more videos like these and be notified when I upload a video, be sure to hit the bell notifications. So, hope you guys enjoyed my video and thanks for watching, guys. Bye!